Hello everyone and welcome back to Moonfox Models. I hope you're doing well. Today we're gonna unbox the Schleich Horse Club Horse Adventure with Car and Trailer playset. Ever since this set was released in 2021, it's been on the top of my wish list because I love camping and I finally found it at a really good price on Amazon. The box is so big that it barely fits in my photo box, but this is the back side with a list of contents along with the measurements of the car and the trailer. We can also see some other horse club playsets down here, as well as pictures of this playset to the right. And I think that's all, it's time to open this now. Hi guys, so things I noticed when unpacking all of this is that Schleich has really, really cut down on the plastic packaging. Things like this windshield were wrapped in tissue paper, which is totally okay. The most important things, at least for me as a collector, is still packed in plastic bags. But, things like all the wheels, and all the super teeny tiny accessories were not packed in plastic bags but instead just packed in a couple of boxes. It's great that Schleich is cutting down on plastic waste. I think that's really good. But just throwing everything together like this. I don't know guys. Anyway, I'm gonna put everything together and then I'll be back. I'm back with everything put together and I just want to warn you that when assembling the car specifically, even the trailer, but mostly the car, you have a hundred pieces going everywhere because Schleich has decided not to use little plastic bags to separate and organize the parts. And I fully support not using plastic bags because less plastic waste is great. But you have a hundred pieces scattered everywhere and you have to hunt through them to try to assemble the car. And the trailer. But still it took me close to an hour to actually finish this. And to be honest with you, I'm not sure where to start the review. As you can see, I decided to start with the car because it's just so cool. It was not the easiest to put together, but I think it was well worth it. And if you keep on watching, I'll show you why. The doors on both sides open and the interior is amazing. Schleck has put so much detail into this and it's really well designed. I am so impressed by this. There's even cup holders in the back seats. I think there's one in the front seats as well. But my favorite detail of this car is that the tires actually say Shetlander. <laughs> I think that is so cute. Let's move on to the trunk. So this opens to reveal this huge space back in the car for all your camping or uh, showing pleasure. You can really put a ton of stuff back here. But that's not what makes this car special. One really great feature of this car is that you can push the back seats down to have even more space. The possibilities with this car are limitless and I love that. Since we started with the car, I think it's only fair that we take the trailer next. This is really detailed and I think this is really well made as well. If we start in the front, in this box we have storage space, which is really cool. On this side, <laughs> it's really dark. We have space for our tack. 
and on this side that space continues all the way through so we have double the space for our tack since this is a two horse trailer it makes sense that we have place for two sets of tack we got stickers to put on this big blank space on both sides but those stickers are of the horse club characters the four main girls and their horses and I don't think that really fits into my collection and we also have windows for the horses to look out here is the back of the trailer this ramp opens and this has some really nice texture both to the ramp and to the flooring so the horses doesn't slip and I'm sorry that it is really dark in there as you can see this is a two horse trailer all the way up in the front there are two indentations to keep feed in the roof can also be removed if you need more light or more space the roof is surprisingly easy to remove and put back on which I love one thing that I miss in this horse trailer is the gates back here it's not the most realistic horse trailer but it is still very pretty and very useful just as with the car we have the railings on the roof to hold the tent and to get up to the tent we also get a ladder now it's time for all the accessories we get a helmet and a body brush a curry comb we get two sleeping bags and the people can actually sit and lay down in these and they are made of real fabric and this elastic down here is so that you can roll them up and they will stay rolled up and for all our grooming supplies we get this really cute grooming box with hearts on it we get a bucket for water or for grain a beautiful red Schleich halter a very detailed bridle in a very dark brown color matching the bridle is this saddle with a lovely red saddle pad and the same dark brown color we also get this hay net that you can hang on the trailer this comes in two pieces so you have to assemble it and it is also very light I am a little bit disappointed in the fact that we have to assemble it and put it together ourselves because I think this could easily have been a solid piece but I like that you can hang it on the trailer we also get a bale of straw I think it's a bit too yellow to be hay this is hollow and also comes in two pieces and needs assembling that has caused this bale of straw to lose a lot of details compared to one of the Schleich original hay bales which I think is a real shame my theory is that they're trying to cut down on plastic and therefore make these hollow and uh, two piece but they lose a lot in quality and I'm very disappointed in that we get this super cute blanket and the pattern is printed directly onto the fabric and the pattern on the blanket matches one of the sleeping bags I think the colors are really pretty on this one I almost forgot to show you guys the tent we get stickers to make it look more realistic and I must say that the heart and four clovers are really cute this fits on the roof of the car and also on the roof of the trailer and if you don't want it pitched all the time you can open this and this will fit about two maybe three dolls but if you want to pack it away you just open it fold this part in on itself 
and then the sides and it shuts like an envelope I really like that it's very clever storage it takes hardly any space at all like this these are our two people it is supposed to be Mr. Kramer and his daughter Hannah out on a camping trip but you can make these characters whoever you want to so this is our first doll and he has printed details on his clothes he can move his arms and he can bend his legs so that he can sit and ride and stand as you wish him to you can also switch out his hair if you want to He's a very detailed model and a little bit taller than the horse club girl, so I think that's really good. And here we have the horse club girl. This is another version of Hannah. She too has printed details in her clothes and you can remove her hat. It matches her boots, which I think is really neat. And she has the bracelet. You can remove this bracelet if you don't want it. You can also remove her hairstyle if you want to switch it out. She too can move her arms and her legs so she can sit down or ride a horse. Here we have the Holsteiner mare and this version of this model is exclusive to this uh, current trailer set. I know this mold is not the favorite of a lot of people but I really like it. I like the pose and I like how she's built and I think these braids in her mane are so cute. She also has this beautiful face marking. On this side you can see the shading a bit better. This is the third version Schleich has released of this mold and let's see how she looks in the tack. I really like how much detail they put into all their accessories nowadays, except for the bale of hay of course. And this horse looks so good in red. Well, she's a chestnut, <laughs> she's already red. Really pretty. She looks just as good in a saddle. But her mane kind of goes under the saddle pad here. But she still looks really good in the red. That was my review of the Schleich Horse Club Horse Adventure with Car and Trailer set. I really like this. I would have changed a few things. But overall this is an amazing playset. I especially love the car. Schleich, if you're hearing this, please, we want more colors on the car. The trailer is also really nice, I love the horse and I'm so happy to have these new 2021-2022 dolls that actually can move their limbs. That's awesome. And I've probably forgotten half of everything cool I could show you about this playset, but you're just gonna have to discover them by yourself. I hope I see you in my next video, until then take care. Remember to always reach for the moon and bye!